Oh, ho, ho. I like it when I get a new tool. Ah, yes. Now, I remember ordering this. This is my Quang Sheng side rebate plane. Well, I guess I might as well do an out of the box review on it. Well, let's start with the packaging. It actually came wrapped in this quite thick plastic bag and it had some rust protection spread on it and I've cleaned all that off. That was wrapped round in some bubble wrap which gave it reasonably good protection. That was then inside a corrugated cardboard box giving it even more protection and that finally was slid into this corrugated cardboard sleeve. So it's arrived to me in very good condition. No sign of any damage en route. So let's work out how it works and whether it's come ready to work. Well a side rebate plane is used for, as it suggests, cleaning up the sides of rebates. You can also use it for cleaning up the sides of dados or grooves as we call them here in the UK. It has a couple of cutters on it, one on either side for going in one direction and also going in the opposite direction. So you can take into account drain direction when you're using it. It has a depth fence on the back side. Also one option with this one I don't know about other ones, but with this one you can take the nose off so it works as a side rebate chisel plane. And that's pretty much it. It's very simple. The blade is held in by this knurled knob pressing down on, I guess you'd call it a lever cap. If we undo that, as you can see there are two blades on other makes. Uh, sometimes the blades overlap and they're bedded at slightly different angles to allow them to do that. But this one they've just kept the blades quite short. And I guess that works just as well. So we'd better go and find a rebate or a groove to try it on. Some of you might uh, recognise this sample piece I made up when I was demonstrating the Stanley 45. I was ploughing a wide, narrow and a custom width groove. So we can use the side rebate plane to clean up the sides of those. Set my depth stop to the depth of the groove. And uh, that seemed to work quite well. I think my depth stop is a little bit too high up. And that's working lovely. I've tried on something a bit more challenging here. I've got a deep rebate. So I reset my depth stop. And that's pretty good. So straight out of the box, those cutters are sharp enough to clean up a rebate. I'm going to retract the blade a little bit and see how it copes with taking a very fine shaving. I must say it's quite difficult to, to move the blade because they're not long and coming right through the body. 
it's a little bit tricky but I can keep trying it on my test shim And that's actually achieving quite a thin shaving. I should think that's probably in the region of about two thou. So in summary then, the Kuaixing side rebate plane comes well packaged, looks nice, functions really well straight out of the box, but it is quite difficult to adjust the depth of cut because you're not able to hold on to the rear end of the cutters. Something else I find a little irritating with it as it comes straight out of the box is that the cutters are set in a way that with the depth stop set correctly they'll cut or they'll score beyond the corner of the cut. To end up with a clean corner in there I'll need to do a little bit of work on the cutters. So not an essential piece of kit around the shop but it can be quite handy and if you can pick one up in a sale like I did with this one I think you'll be pleased that you did.